Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. While formatting and printing various sections of your Gantt chart view is useful when discussing your project plan with others, you may also need to illustrate other aspects of your project with reports. Microsoft Project comes with many project-related reports that you can use to show data regarding the overall progress of your project, report costs, show work schedules, and much more. To open a report, click the Project tab that appears within the ribbon, and then click the Reports button that appears within the Reports button group. In the Reports dialog box that appears, you'll see the report categories that are available. Overview, Current, Costs, Assignments, Workload, and Custom. To view the reports that are available within any category shown, click on the icon for that report category and then simply click the Select button. Another window will appear that shows you the various reports within the selected category. If you wish to edit a report's settings prior to opening it in Print Preview, first select the report within the window and then click the Edit button to open a dialog box for the selected report where you can change the settings as desired. Note that the settings that are available will vary depending upon the report you selected. When you are finished setting your custom options, simply click the OK button to then apply them. You can then click on the name of the report you would like to display within this window, and then click the Select button that appears to open the report in Print Preview so that you can see how it looks before it's printed. Now in the print preview, you can click the report preview shown at the right side of the backstage view to either zoom in on the data or display one full page. In a multi-page report, you can click on a page shown to zoom in on the selected page. You can also use the buttons that appear at the bottom of the preview in order to navigate through the information. Now in the area to the left of the print preview, you can set whatever report and page setup options are available. You can enter the number of copies to print into the copies text box and select a printer from the printer dropdown. Below that, you can set some commonly used page setup options. If you wish to add header and footer information, then simply click the page setup hyperlink shown in this area to open the page setup dialog box. The tabs that are shown are Page, Margins, Header, and Footer, and you can click on the desired tab to change report options for the designated section within the report. Once you set any options as needed, you can simply click the OK button within the Page Setup dialog box to close it. Once you've finished changing your report settings and previewing your report data, you can click the large print button that appears within the backstage view to print the selected report. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.